Ethereum breaks towards all-time highs as Bitcoin breaks its all-time highs of $60,000. Where is Ethereum heading in the coming hours? Some really exciting chart analysis, some really exciting Ethereum price predictions coming up. So make sure you stick around to the end of the video to be kept up to date with all things Ethereum. Guys, welcome to the House of Crypto. I make videos predominantly about Ethereum, Bitcoin, and altcoins. So make sure you hit that like and subscribe button if you want to be kept up to date with all of the latest happening in those cryptocurrencies. Without further ado, then let's jump on over to the chart. Okay, so obviously the video is about Ethereum today, but I want to draw your attention first to Bitcoin. And the reason for that is, as you know, Bitcoin is the biggest uh, biggest market cap in crypto, and it brings all of the uh, brings all of the money into uh, the marketplace first before it starts to flow into other things. So we see a bit of a sort of a time lag on things like Ethereum uh, against Bitcoin. So Bitcoin makes the move and Ethereum will tend to follow it. And as just from when I've sort of started to make this video, I've seen Ethereum be push up, uh, pushing up in price, which is really exciting to see. So uh, what we can see in terms of what's happened in Bitcoin, we've seen various sort of uh, patterns, uh, triangles been playing out over the past sort of month or so. And this is over on the four hour. We've had this, uh, this triangle break out to the top side. And what we see is if we take our, our low to our top, then we're gonna have a price target here, which will bring us up to just, just under $62,000. What's nice to see, and in fact we've seen it on the Ethereum chart that's happening now, is that we've had this breakout, and now we've pushed back down to the downside to have a little retest, and now you see it's being rejected uh, coming down, it's being bought up, and it's being pushed up to the upside, which is really, really exciting and really healthy to see, okay? Uh, so in terms of where this previous all-time high was, we've seen uh, this now being flipped into support. And if this four-hour candle can stay above this and create a new candle, then Bitcoin is looking extremely bullish and exciting. And, you know, as we know, once we break up into unknown territory, then the future uh, is kind of very exciting and we can see huge price increases very fast. Now, Ethereum is not quite at its all-time high yet, so I want to just look at what is going on over here. So... Uh, the other day, if you watched my video on Thursday, I drew I drew your attention to this falling falling flag. Oh, sorry, this bullish flag pattern. So what we see is a bit of a fall, and every time it gets kind of bored up, pushes back up, and it's getting soft, getting squeezed, squeezed down into this sort of like this flag shaped pattern here. So if if you want to see exactly what that looks like, so we've got this bullish flag here, and obviously this is a slightly different shaped flag. But we take from flag pole one, which is down the bottom of where. Uh, where it all starts, uh, and I'll draw, show you show you where that is on the Ethereum chart, and then we take this uh, area down here all the way up to here as our new target price. So, so why is that so exciting, and why should you be so excited as an Ethereum holder? So, what that means, guys, we we come from this uh, this area, this low here, where we had this big drop and found support. We came all the way back up here, and we have this flagpole, and we then take it to the base or sorry, the lowest point of the flag, which is around here, and then you can see this brings us all the way up to $2,156. Sorry, $2 okay, so previous all-time high was around $2040. Okay, so another significant $120 on that price, which is awesome and really exciting. And as we can see, what's happened here is we've had the breakout. We've had the big in the last sort of the previous candle, we broke all the way up to the upside, saw a bit of resistance. Uh, and then now we've pushed up and we're now looking very strong because we've got this retest. And if we drop down to perhaps a one hour, we might see how we've retested this area. Okay, so we've pushed up, found a bit of resistance where we've wicked up. And now we've got this green candle where we come all the way back down and we've wicked to the downside, which means there's now significant buying pressure at this high point here, which is really great to see. And what we want to see play out is the next candle close above this this blue line of 1865, which is previously significant line of resistance for us. And then we will see this push up and it should, in theory, complete its way to the pattern. Now, obviously, all time highs can be a bit of a struggle to break through. So what we might see uh, is a push to this area here. And if we come back to the, the pattern that we looked at before, where we had this uh, sort of shoulder, shoulder here, this head pattern here, and then a shoulder here. And the way that usually plays out is we take from the the top of the neckline, okay, all the way down to the top of the headline, and then we move it all the way back to the neckline, and then that brings us all the way back up to the all-time high here. Okay, so that should, this pattern, combined with this pattern, is gonna push us towards all-time highs. And you know, 
given that Bitcoin's already broken out and Bitcoin will continue to surge, in my opinion, uh, I can see Ethereum pushing towards its all-time highs, maybe even today. And then we might see maybe a bit of resistance here before breaking and continuing up to this pattern. And then, as you know, guys, once we get into kind of clear blue skies where we haven't had previous levels of resistance, then we, we can see significant surges to the upside. What we might see is like this, where we come up and we, we, we make these consolidation patterns. And if we jump over to Bitcoin, every time we've surged up to these new levels, we tend to have a bit of a consolidation pattern before breaking higher. Okay, So we can see that happening time and time again. And the, these, these chart patterns are actually quite easy to learn, guys. There's, there's some great videos available on YouTube about identifying these chart patterns. If you want me to make a video about how to identify these chart patterns, then make sure you leave a comment below and I'll see if I can, uh, see if I can make a video for you on that. Um, because once you can start identifying these patterns, it becomes kind of like semi, well, I'm not gonna say easy, but much easier to identify roughly what might be happening. Okay, so once it's in the pattern, we don't know whether it's gonna break exactly to the top side or to the bottom side, but you know, it gives us the indication where if it breaks the top, then we know where it's gonna go, and if it breaks the bottom, then we also know where it's gonna go as well. So, super exciting, guys. Hope you, uh, I just wanted to give you a really quick video today, but before I, uh, before I finish up, just wanna jump over to the ETH, uh, the Ethereum Bitcoin chart, uh, and as you see, what we've had is this sort of falling pattern. What's really cool to see here uh, is Ethereum kind of bottoming out, and it's found this line of support, and it's done it one, two, if you count these, or three, four, and now it's hit a fifth time. Uh, today it's wicked all the way down, and it's now starting to push. So this is really, really bullish for Ethereum against Bitcoin, particularly as Bitcoin is also flying. Uh, today and we're going to see something really exciting happening with Ethereum. As you can see, Ethereum currently up over seven percent, Bitcoin up over five percent. So you know, the perhaps the the last few weeks have been a bit bit of a tough time, having having grown to expect uh, Ethereum and Bitcoin to be flying all the way up. But you know, and it will happen again in this bull cycle. But there's plenty plenty more upside to come. Obviously, guys, just a disclaimer: trading is risky. Don't don't risk more money than you can afford to lose. Okay, you've worked hard for your money, so don't go and throw it away. Uh, and always go and do your own research, okay? There's a lot of people on YouTube and other places giving their opinions, uh, of which I'm now giving you my opinion, okay? So use my analysis, use the news I bring to you, but also go away and do your own research to keep yourself as safe as possible and always be able to come back tomorrow to be trading and making more money. The future is looking really, really bright for Ethereum and so exciting to see this after after yesterday, or sorry, after Thursday's video, where we're talking about all that really, really exciting news. I'll connect that to the end of this video as well as I covered a, a tech stock the other day which has huge upside potential for maybe you know, 10x this year. So I'll leave links to those in the end of the video. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe video. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button to be kept up to date with all things Ethereum, Bitcoin, and altcoins. Guys, have a nice day and I will see you next time for another video. Thank you, bye-bye.